Hi there. I've got some Gabor wigs to show you today. We've got Renew in Sugared Smoke 305C. Devotion in GL1526, also called Buttered Toast. And the adorable Innuendo in G6 Plus Coffee Mist. I've also got it in the G27 Plus Ginger Mist, which is the one that you see in the photos in the advertisements for it. And a third color, G20 Plus, which is Wheat Mist. So I'm going to throw them all on for you so you can see the styles, look at the colors, and here we go. Okay, so this is Renew in Sugared Smoke. It's a beautiful silver gray, lighter in the front, getting darker around the nape of the neck. So I'll just turn around. A bit longer back here. Not too long, but covers your neck. And yeah, it's just regular open cap construction. Nice price point, and it's a pretty wig. And I, I don't know if I like that I like gray on myself, but I, I don't mind it. Anyway, next one. Coming up, Devotion. I should also point out, this is the same color that's in the photo which I posted earlier, the one that you see in the advertisements, and it is, um, it's an average cap size. It does have does have some stretch to it though. And it's a little bit longer on, oh. I don't know if it's quite asymmetrical, but you've got a little extra length. It's not just a straight across it, so you can bring that down a little bit there if you want to. And this is Devotion in Buttered Toast. Where is my tag? Which is, oh, I can't read that, 1526, GL1526. Again, um, average cap, but it's got some decent give to it. Uh, bangs are pretty much the length I would have them already. And it's pretty cute, actually. It's been a long time since I, well, I haven't had it forever anyway, but... I haven't had this one out of the box in a little while, and um, I like it better than in the photo when it's it's winging out a bit too much. So anyway, I'll do a little spin. Haven't brushed it; I'm just sort of finger combing it into place. Permatees. And that's Devotion by Gabor. Uh, next coming up is Innuendo in three colors. Having a little camera trouble here, so I just wanted to show that uh, this would, it's an average cap size, but its it's got little room. The sample tab stretches down to here. Sometimes they only come up to about here on me. Let's see. Both sides there, coming down to where my thumbnail is going in. And let's do a little behind the ear. Too much ear. And this is Innuendo in G27 Plus, which is Ginger Mist. And that is the same color in the photos that you see online, the one that the main photo that advertises for this wig. Um, in person, it's, it's really not quite as red. There is a red to it, uh, maybe more strawberry blonde, it's, but it's not quite as red as what you see in the photos. So if you're looking for that exact color, you might be a little bit disappointed, but I have to say it is still a beautiful color. And um, yeah, I've got, there's indirect sunlight. It's fairly sunny out, but none of it's coming in here. And I've also got my bedroom light on here. So see the top. I don't know if that'll help. There's blonde, strawberry blonde in it. Yeah, it 
It's got a little bit of flipping around in the back. And it's a very cute wig. It's a, it's a bob. It's a flippy little kind of razor cut bob. A little bit windblown. Casual and cute. You can tuck it behind your ears. Stick it in your eye. <laughs> and, and there you go. So I've got two more colors to try of it. And I'll just show you actually on the wheat mist before I put it on. So here's a the next one I'm going to try on. Sorry, it's really trying to get into my eye here. The bangs are a little bit long on this, I find, and I've got a very high forehead, so I'm guessing that will mean most people are going to want to trim the bangs a little bit. But wheat, wheat mist is up next. <laughs> Seriously? Come on! And the inside of the cap, these are open cap. You've got your mole skin at the front at the forehead. And at the nape of the neck, it is straight across. It does not uh, extend downward, but it does again have the mole skin and it's got the Velcro tabs, which I have to say I do love those. Also, for those of you who wear glasses and like them, they've got the open ear tabs. For me, I actually just, when I put my readers on, I just stick them right on over top of the whole thing. I don't. I don't get them in, in the wig. I, I definitely don't put them under the ear tabs, but I, I don't worry about trying to get them inside. I just put them right over top, and that seems to work for me. So Anyway, ginger mist. I just popped this on, so I thought I'd show you while I'm fixing it up a bit. So this is the wheat mist. It's not rooted. Uh, neither was the ginger mist, so if you want to have a look at the top, see if you can see the permatease going on or not. I think it's pretty good. Try not to poke my eye out again. Oops, a little spin. Have a look at the top there. Hope my head's still on the screen. Keep it messy. At least a little bit messy. Really. Definitely, for me, would need a bang trim, or just get it more off, off my face. That's better. Nice color. Very blonde. Very pretty blonde. And again, lots of stretch in this. And the ear tabs. This would, uh, I think this would be good. I don't know about large, but... Um, Average, an average plus a bit, I think, should be quite comfortable. Now, well, last one coming up, Coffee Mist. And now we've got Coffee Mist, G6+. Plus. Darker than the other ones. Darker than what I would normally wear, but... But you can always work with a little bit of makeup, a little bit of lipstick to help uh, bring out more color. So, give her a spin. Not sure what the back looks like, I didn't really check. So these ones are cute. They're short, short angled chiseled little bobs with flips and but not too much. And then, you know, you can put it behind one or both ears. Sorry, I scratch my nose a lot because when the fibers, when I'm putting them on, they tickle my nose. So it's not running, it's scratching. Anyway, I hope you all have a great evening and I'm going to figure out what I'll show you tomorrow. Bye.